Good evening, I'm Wynn Moore. Thanks for joining us tonight. A fire in Northport has left one family displaced tonight. More in tonight's top story. Northport Fire and Rescue responded to Northbrook Apartments around 5.30 this evening. According to fire officials, the blaze appears to have started in the kitchen. The flames were contained to that area, but there was significant smoke damage to the living room and laundry room. The rest of the building's tenants had to be evacuated. They will be able to return home tonight. The same cannot be said, however, for the family living in the apartment where it started. Officials say the cause of the fire is under investigation. The Crimson Tide is headed to Atlanta next weekend to take on the Georgia Bulldogs in the SEC championship game. And tickets are already on sale. Prices for those tickets continue to climb as both Alabama and Georgia demolished their biggest in-state rivals yesterday. A few hours ago, the cheapest ticket on StubHub.com was $324. And that's not for seats from far, far from the top of the dome. Seats close to the field averaged over $1,000. This game determines who will compete in the BCS National Championship game against Notre Dame in Miami. Bradley Whittington will have more on that matchup coming up in sports. Some West Alabama residents may be getting a questionable text message on their cell phone. It may look like this. And claim you have won a gift card to Target. The message also urges people to go to a website and claim their prize. Target officials say that this is a scam and is in no way affiliated with their store. One Target employee told WVUA, uh, WVUA this uh, common during holiday season. So everyone needs to be extra careful when trusting deals that seem too good to be true. The countdown to the holidays has begun. We are now officially one month away from Christmas. Hanukkah is just 24 days away. And the holiday spirit is visible all around town. Kids tell us they can't wait till the reindeer and sleigh show up at their house. And WVUA caught up with Santa Claus who says there is still more time to make it for kids on the naughty list, or the nice list, excuse me. Uh, for the University of Alabama, I'm Wynn Moore. <laughs> Apparently the hair does too.